Okay. Oh, he's good. Good afternoon, people. A couple of days ago, I did the Saturday challenge with Randy. Today, I'm doing a sandwich challenge with Katina. Who's got the biggest capacity? You and Randy? I think Randy really has the bigger capacity. Okay. He eats more often than I do, and he's just a big human. So I actually attempt this challenge before. They have this challenge that's ongoing. Seven or eight sandwiches with two sides, which is the one that Randy is doing. So the one we're doing is going to be like a combined effort of 20 sandwiches. We have to be extra hungry for this. Yeah, we got this, we got this. <laughs> what is your capacity like? How many pounds? Especially after doing Zha Myung last night, I think I'm gonna be up to like three kilos, three and a half. Then yeah. that should be a walk in the park. Should be okay. <laughs> I hope Randy can do this as well. Because the challenging part about this challenge is the sandwich is a little bit toasty. So it's a little bit sharp on the edges. Can't really go that quick. Okay. But I think it's okay. We yeah, got this. We I think we'll this. be good. I'm pretty good without using a lot of liquid. So I'll Oh be able yeah, to yeah. Like... I seen her doing the jajangmyeon yesterday and she did the whole thing without taking even a sip of water, which I'm very, very impressed. <laughs> so we'll see how this goes today. This is what we'll be doing today. 20 sandwiches. The other time I did, I think eight with two sides. Yeah. And it was kind of rough. But today we, we decided to up the game. They have this team challenge that involves 20 sandwiches. Okay, but today, right, this one we've got 45 minutes. Oh. Do you think we can finish this in time? I, I'm hoping so. My hope is actually for less than 30, just less because 30. like wow. I feel like these want to be like nice and toasty. I won't be talking that much because uh, I think that is close to maybe 7 kg plus of food. <laughs> so this is going to be... But today I got a very good teammate. Uh. So uh, I, think, I think we got this. And then uh, I won't be talking so much. If you guys want to know each and every flavor, right? I did a mukbang here uh, during the previous challenge, so uh, the video will be here. Okay, so check it out, and then let's get started. Let's do it. <sighs> Wait, okay. Which sandwich do you want to start with? Oh, I think I want to start with the Jet Barbecue you one. You want to start with Jet Barbecue one? Okay, yeah. Okay. okay, we're gonna start with one of the collaboration sandwiches here with Jet Barbecue. I actually got to meet Jet the other day, so we'll start with that one and then uh, work our way through the rest. But anyways, ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Sandwich eaten yeah. time. Okay, All right. this. Oh, this looks amazing. Let's go. Ooh. There we go. Oh, mama. Mmm. Mmm. I love this challenge. Mmm. I think most of that sandwiches are really heavy. Yeah. These are not for skinny folks. <laughs> oh, I don't know what this is. This is something new to me as well. This is a croak, I think. Croak, croak, croak. Yeah. Mm. I saved one for you. Okay, cool. That one looks good. This is the croak. Yeah. The croak, okay. Croc Monsieurs are one of my favorite sandwiches when I'm in France. And so I'm really excited to try this one. Oh yeah. Legend. Mm. Hey, the avocado one really good. Eh? The other one I didn't get to try. Actually, I think I need to try Jack sandwich. Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna try. This is the. Is this the Cali one with avocado in it? Oh, uh, is it? Is this Cali? It's avocado, right? Oh, oh counter. Okay, this one's called the the kyauta. A little bit, a little bit spicy. Okay, that'll be fine. That'll be fine. Very mild heat. Very. Subtle. Although a little bit spicy in Singapore can sometimes mean very spicy. That's Thailand. <laughs> Wait, I need a burp. I need a burp. Uh. Yes. Oh, that felt so good. Legend. Mm. Mm. Little jet one, jet one, yeah. Final bite of sandwich number who knows. Oh, that, that barbecue sandwich is so good. Mm. 
it's like some Southwest barbecue thing. Oh, they, they have this vegan option. Oh. It's something new. Randy didn't get to try it. Okay. Okay, it's thank you. tofu, I don't know. Ooh. Are you keeping up with them? I'm trying to. I think we're pacing. I don't know. God, he burps I know. I love it. He's a legend. Amazing. This is really good. They do good, like, Instagrammable sandwiches here. The tofu is fried like a hash brown. Mm. And I think that's what makes it kind of tricky to eat, is because it makes the sandwich so thick. Mm. You like it? I do. It's just I tricky. I do like this one. It's tricky. I can't, I can't like, eat it easy. I'm very, I'm very honest when it comes to whether the food is good or not. Mm -hmm. But I think every single sandwich is excellent. As this one is, I don't know. It tastes too lean to me. Mm -hmm. How's the grilled cheese? It's really nice. It's like child, childhood. Really? When we're sick, we eat like grilled cheese and tomato soup. The owner, Daphne, she's like, she's right there. Yeah. And she's very worried if we say shit about her sandwiches. Oh, I'm not talking any crap. No, so far, it's been really good. Who's your favorite competitive eater? Ooh, competitive. I really like Jeff Esper. Oh yeah, I like that him That man well. is so chill, so humble. And he could do like, I don't know, like 20 pounds of. Oh, he's so like relaxed about it too. He just like casually like will sit there and smash like 20 pounds of mac and cheese. It's like god tier. Yeah. Oh. All right, time for my half of the Cali, or my whole of the Cali. <laughs> I think this is another classic oh, chicken. One, the, the heat will be up. Mm -hmm. yeah. That one got me. I'm thankful you like it. It's not classic, yeah. Yeah. And there's another one there, right? And why did they give us so much classic? Yeah, started? I think there's three, and these are heavy. Hey. Uh -huh. Daphne, huh? Mm-hmm. It's a stitch up. Have you tried the one with Spam yet? Mm-mm. Okay, that one is like my favorite. Okay. Even though it's the most simple mm -hmm. option, but it's mm -hmm. not my favorite. I'm excited to try that. Oh, I'm slowing down probably because I'm still full of Shao Shao Young. <laughs> mm. All right. Let's that was that. like less than 24 hours ago. I have lots of room for ice cream right now. They serve really out. good cheesecakes. Mm. Daphne, you guys love cheesecakes, right? She need dessert later. Uh-huh. I say that now, but right now I'm also dying. <laughs> it is dense. <sighs> oh, I'm starting to feel it. Oh. Mm-hmm. It's hitting heavy. I'm not like maxed out, but I'm starting to feel it. Like so much protein. I think, yeah. But I'm in the same boat where I'm not, I don't think I'm full, but my body is like, dude, stop. Yeah. Oh, we got this. Should be walking apart. Oh, yeah. Unless the uh, hot chick kills us. We saved that one for the last. Mm. It's indescribable. A lot of people, that's like a common question. Like, are you always really, really full? And it's like, nah. Sometimes you stop yeah, because it like, stop because it, it feels weird. The taste fatigue and mm -hmm. everything. Oh, no, oh there's really jalapenos soft. in this one. I'm scared. Ugh. <laughs> He's so good. Reina, Reina, she told me she can't burp at all. I can't imagine that. She's probably like conditioned to it. She drinks like a three liters of Coke Zero a day. Oh. <laughs> no, <you don't> <laughs> Hard. 4250. In a moment, Kel. Right at 44. She's got time. There we go. Ooh. Ah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Woo! Good work. Cool time too. 4440. Oh wow, nice. That's a neat time. What do you think? Uh, the challenge. So much food. 
And it was like all very hearty. Yeah, it is for sure. All very hearty and filling. Like one of those sandwiches would easily feed you for like the day and you'd be fine. I think my favorite was the classic chicken and my then favorite. the egg and spam. Yeah, same. What was classic and egg and spam? Yeah. <laughs> Jet Barbecues was kind of cheating because that was a collab with a barbecue place. Yeah, the barbecue was really good as well. That one was awesome. But, and also it kind of cheated for me because it was the first one and I was really hungry, but thankfully for winning. Okay, Katina just did an outro. I'm going to go ahead and end this video now. I thought the sandwiches were really good today. Like most of it was really good, except for one, which is the tofu one. I think they should remove that from their menu. Oh, it's so chewy. Other than that, everything's really, really good. Uh, happy to have Katina here with me. I didn't know she's a Dragon Ball fan until I met her in <laughs> Singapore. Uh, okay, but uh, the tattoos. Yeah, but, but how, 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 what do you think of it? Like, are you, are you maxed out now, like capacity wise? I'm not maxed out. Like right now, like a milkshake sounds fabulous. Okay. Um, okay, but I'm definitely salted out. Like salt is yeah. done. A no more salt. Protein, yeah. That's it, okay? That's oh. it. We're gonna go ahead and end this video. Uh, if you guys like Katina, please check out her channel. Uh, all the links will be down in the description. Again, we are back breakfast grill. And yeah, that's it. I'll see you guys in the next one.